Let's uh, cover HTML lists. Uh, I've got a basic uh, document up, one that we've talked a lot about, uh, an index.html. It starts with a doc type. Uh, we go into HTML, it says here comes some HTML inside our head. We've got a head, we're going to give it a title of HTML lists. Um, head, body, and then we can go ahead and start with some of our lists right here. In fact, we'll just call it that P welcome to HTML lists. Right. If you remember the, the P tag is the paragraph tag, it just that's how you can wrap your uh, text around that P tag. All right, uh, lists. There are there, there are really uh, two common types of lists, uh, ordered lists and unordered lists. Let's go ahead and, um, and start with unordered lists or the UL tag. In HTML, we, we start with UL and then we will list, list item, um, and let's say Coke. Uh, let's do another list item. So again, this is gonna be a way of listing um, these uh, each of these items in an unordered way so coke pepsi um, dr pepper that should probably be at the top of the list oh we're doing an unordered list that's right root beer Close the list item, list item, and Sprite. And then we go ahead and close out our unordered list. Now, how do you expect this to delay, uh, display in the browser? Well, we'll go ahead and save that. If you think about what it's gonna do right here, I'll go ahead and drop that there. So we've got our unordered lists. Coke, Pepsi, Dr. Pepper, and it puts little bullets next to it. So if I go back to the code, we can we can uh, we can change out some of the the different attributes that are part of the listing. Let's say we wanted to change the bullet to say something else like a square. So we can come in here and we can say type equals quote square. And go ahead and save that. Come back to our browser. Let me increase that size a little bit so it's a little easier to see and hit refresh and we went from little bullets to to little squares and if we wanted to make that into a circle I could come in here and change out square to circle save that come back to our browser hit refresh and all of a sudden we have those little circles um, if we want it to be a little disc again these are just different uh, options type options in terms of attributes uh, as, it, as it do that. So we can, we can also type in disk. Save that, hit refresh, and there are little disks. Well, let's create some uh, other kind of lists or ordered lists. So I'm gonna go OL, bracket OL, and uh, let's do is our list items. Um, find a job list item uh, get money <laughs> you guys never think about that do you and list item um, buy an iMac you're going to need that for school Now, what do you expect this to display? I'm going to go ahead and throw a little uh, line break up here. What would you expect this to display? Well, I'll go ahead and save that, bring that back in, into the browser, and all of a sudden we get one, uh, two, and three. Now, 
what if I wanted to, to list it out a little bit different? So I wanted to change the type on that. So let's play with different types uh, for this. So I go type equals uh, quote capital I. How is that going to list out? Well, it's going to list it out in Roman numerals. Um, I think that's about all you need to know about lists. So those are lists.